guys? How's everybody doing? Yeah. 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 I uh, woke up this morning and was feeling really good. So I called in healthy. <laughs> Said, uh, yeah, Phil, I don't think I'm going to make it into work today. No, quite the opposite. Feeling too good. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to come in there and ruin it. Because <laughs> I feel like feeling good is what life's about, you know what I mean? You guys, are we off here? You guys get that? Yeah. People tell you, it's about feeling good, you know what I mean? It's like, because you're feeling good, nobody can fuck with you or say anything, you know? Like, you're feeling good, somebody's like, you suck, and you're like, no, I don't, I'm cool. <laughs> If you're feeling bad, somebody's like, you suck, you're a loser. You're like, I'm a horrible father, <laughs> even though I don't have any kids. <laughs> but that, the world kind of like, you guys know the people that'll be like, you, you come up to them and you're like, I'm feeling really good today. And they're like, I don't know if you should be feeling good. <laughs> I know somebody who was feeling good once and things didn't really turn out that good for them. But that's what it's about, you know? Like I met this uh, this 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 older guy yesterday. He was like, uh, "Man, when you get older, you'll realize it's all about hard work. It's not about feeling good. I think when you get older and you put some more years on you, you'll start taking life more seriously." And I was like, "Excuse me, sir. Uh, you're gonna die soon, <laughs> and then you're gonna take life less seriously, and then you're gonna understand what I'm talking about." Because he's going to go to heaven. You know what I mean? <laughs> I uh, started dating this yoga chick recently. I was doing yoga. And um, everything was going really good until she caught out child's pose. And I uh, shit my pants. <laughs> <laughs> she was really deep, though. You guys know the, the, you know the people that are like real deep? Like, they say stuff like, All I know is that I know nothing. All I know is that I know nothing. And then she would get pissed at me when I wouldn't listen to her. It's like, yo, dude, I'm not gonna listen to somebody that doesn't know shit. And the other thing was like, and, and I feel like guys will know what I'm talking about in this, is like, she was like really honest, which like was really bad for sex. Because like, we need to be lied to about our dicks, you know what I mean? Like, if you tell if you tell somebody like, oh my God, that's so big. The dick is gonna get bigger. <laughs> you know, that's just how it, how it rolls. <laughs> but she was like always really honest. It wouldn't give me that, you know what I mean? So like we'd be having sex and be like, you just wanna get fucked, don't you? She'd be like, I don't know. <laughs> And then we'd be having, you know, then we'd be fucking and be like, does that feel good, baby? She'd be like, uh, kind of. And then afterwards, we'd be like, did you come? She'd be like, uh, I don't know, kind of. <laughs> See if I can pull this shit together. <laughs> I like to call places I don't work at and quit. I like to call TGI Fridays on a Tuesday. They answer. I quit. It's bullshit. It's not Friday every day. I wish it was. It's not. It's Tuesday. All right. Well, let's. How much time do I have left? About three minutes. Three minutes. All right, guys. Let's just take the three minutes that I have remaining. Let's just talk about how I can get you guys to vote for me. <laughs> Obviously, something, hold on. Uh, here, I'll tell you what happened. I'll tell you why I'm, I'm a little fucked up right now. Okay, I'll tell you why. I was feeling really good. I came in, I was feeling great. And then I remembered this shit about you bring your friends to this shit, right? And I was like, fuck, I didn't bring any friends. And then I started like, oh, fuck. And then I noticed uh, Sheldon brought some friends. And then another comedian brought friends. I was like, fuck, I'm going to lose. So then I just got off my shit. So, yeah, don't vote for me because I did suck. But vote for me anyway. You know what I mean? 
I, I get it. But it's a great lesson. Because comedy is like, comedy's not about being funny. It's not. It's just about like feeling good on stage. It's all about practicing your vibration of feeling good. You don't even have to say funny shit. You just have to give the impression like you're funny. And I just wasn't doing that. Because I was like, ner cause like I was like, fuck. I didn't bring anybody. And these people are freaking me out right here. I don't think I'm getting their vote. This guy especially. He's got his arms crossed. It's like, fuck, lighten up, man. I got, this dude's on his phone the whole time. He's on his phone. I just started getting in my head. She's, they, these two are cool. How many people are in here? What do we got? I need, like, what? At least three-fourths of these fucking people to vote for me. Five, six, seven, eight, ten, thirteen, sixteen. 16. At least 20, 20. So... Ten people, that's all I'm asking. Ten people. I know you guys brought your friends, so I could have your vote, maybe. Or you guys are with it, so you guys, I got, you guys got one vote, that's true. <laughs> left. You guys got one vote left. In that one vote, vote for me. <laughs> Next time, I promise I will do another better job. Why am I getting that red shit? I don't think that was three minutes. Next time, I promise I will do a better job. I fucked up this time, I got in my head, I ate Mexican food before I came here, that shit fucks me up, like, mentally. It's like chips and salsa and fucking whatever was on that shit. I got fucked up, I'm sorry. Please don't ruin my chance to represent South Carolina because of one couple bad thoughts. This guy's not voting for me, I can already tell he's already making a quick thing. Somebody. What's the light situation again? What? what? You have 30 seconds. Okay. <laughs> Guys, let's make America great again. I, I fucking hate that, make America great again, because it's just like, make America white again. America's never been great. It's been okay for some people. Sometimes. You know what I mean? America's only great if everyone...